okay so let's look at uh, our last example in this tutorial okay so our last example is actually very interesting it's uh, also a piecewise function uh, which is minus cos squared uh, x from minus pi uh, to 0 then we have positive cos squared x uh, from 0 to, to pi okay so let's look at what we have So that's that's our that's our plan. That's our x y plan. Okay. So here, once again, I advise you to be looking at each function one by one to simplify your work. So this is minus pi, minus pi over two. We have pi over two, and and pi itself. Okay, so now, uh, for this one here, uh, one thing you know is that minus pi, uh, this minus pi here is going to give you a 1. If you plug in, you're saying f of x is equals to minus cos squared, cos squared x, okay? This is going to give you a positive number, okay? Because this can also be written as... Um, this can also be written as minus. It's more like open bracket. You say cos, cos x squared. So now, if you come and plug in, um, if you come and plug in, uh, um, what value is this? If you come and plug in pi minus pi, you're going to get um, with the presence of this negative here, you're going to end up getting what? Getting a one. So your graphs are going to be something like this, uh, up to, uh, no, this is, this is actually going to pass through. So it's going to start from here, it's going to start from here, coming like that, passing through that up to zero. Then another one is going to start from zero on the top here, then pass through that point and you have that there okay so that's how we um, we sketch that one 